Trials Riders. The graceful daredevils of the dirt riding world. Men and women of steel, guts, and oversized gonads. Well, that's the A-grade riders. Then there's us. The average Joes, the dirt muppets, the trials gumbies. Pete is a perfect example. Pete has a trials bike that he rides very occasionally and today is his first ever trials competition with the Western District's Trials Club. Will we see incredible stunts and gravity defying leaps up vertical faces? No. <laughs> Will we see someone having a pile of fun? Yes. In fact, Pete often has too much fun and can't be very serious. But let's ask him how the day is going anyway. Yeah, come along today to the Western District Club and it was just a really good day. <laughs> come on, mate. And, um... <laughs> Close. Okay, so much for that. Oh my God, he's on the tyre. How did you get up there? The hallmark of a trials event is its laid back nature. In effect, you aren't really competing <laughs> against each other, but against the terrain. So riders tend to be very supportive of each other, and the atmosphere is one of having fun, regardless of your age, gender, or bike brand, with the possible exception for full taco riders. Okay, and here we have the illustrious Pete. He's gonna show us how the pros do it. Look at the style and the grace and the poise. He's following the... Well, he's taking the blue arrows. He's taking the C-class line here. So, very nice. Didn't put a foot down. He's going C-class again. Damn. This will be a tricky turn. One. Really good. He went the C-class line and only put one foot down. Very good for somebody who's just started. There we go. Pete's doing pretty well so far. He might be going for the C-grade lines. Okay, back to Pete. We'll see if he's being serious yet. I have to disguise my voice so that you don't <laughs> recognise who I am for a current affair. An interesting aspect of trials is how it rubs off on your riding style in other types of riding. The focus on balance, body positioning, picking lines, and techniques for getting over obstacles can have a huge impact on how you ride dirt bikes. Take it away, Pete. That's the one, Pete. No pressure. If you look at the pro riders in Extreme Enduro, you find about 90% of them are former trials champions, using those hard-won skills to the max. for the easier line there. Caution is the better side of Allah. Okay, Pete seems to have settled down. Let's try talking to him again. Barry wants me to say things nice about the club, but they're a bunch of 
take that as fucking given, <laughs> all right? <laughs> no, actually, it's a really good day today. Give her enough. And uh, we had a really good time. It's just come midweeker, unemployed, old farts, young farts. Like that. People just giving it a go, having a trollsy. Pull up a section is at the end. Everybody's having fun. Good blokes, good times. Come along. Western Six Trolls Club. He got totally lost in there, which is uh, normally why we walk the section first. He's lost. So, want some balance in your life? Get into trials, folks. 